yo. And also, like, when you be yourself, um, when you clip up around people that, that's themselves and that you align with them, when you be yourself around the crowd or, like, with, with your, like, other people and shit like that, then you, you feel, like, this guilt or this shame, like, oh, why should I feel like this? Oh, should I buy, like, be myself, like, oh, there's guilt and shit like that. Like, that shit ain't, that shit ain't, like, that shit ain't your fucking feelings or whatever. It's just some bullshit insecurity that's projected and shit like that. Just trying to make you, like, feel some type of way. Because they don't have that, that, that type of piece of them. And most of the time, it's just from attention. They have lack of attention. They, they have a lack of, um, they have something like a trauma, childhood trauma and shit like that. And then they like to project that shit out. Because everything starts from, everything has a starting point. You know, when you become a child, you grow up as an adult. You start to uh, um, to express what you um, start to express what you uh, like. You start to express your character and shit like that. You start to express yourself. So like all that shit that they project and just you being yourself and shit like that. You did the work. You healed yourself. You did everything. And you should be going out there and express yourself. And then all you have is like fucking fart clouds. And it's oh. Oh, like, you know, you, you know, you walk around a motherfucking room, you just walk and just be yourself and shit like that. You have no type of baggage, no type of shame or guilt. Here come, here come like these fart clouds and shit like that. You just start noticing how niggas be moving and shit like that. Not to say pay attention to every fucking detail, but you just know it. Like, not like, you just, you just, uh, you will, you will, like, don't use your knowledge as a, as a, as a narc. Or whatever. Don't use your knowledge to take over people and shit like that. But you just know, like, what's going on. You don't have to be, like, the big head and around the room and shit like that. But you just know, like, okay, bro, like, I'm just being myself. Why you gotta act like that? Why you gotta be like this? I'm not gonna bite you. I'm not, I'm not doing shit. I'm just being myself. Let the wrong with you. And that shit inspire you to be yourself. But not, like, in a, in a, in a nasty way. But, like, in a, okay, everybody, everybody can, like, you know, be themselves. And that's how this world should be. Instead of everybody being in the, like individuals, but in their own type of in their own type of world, they should be individuals. Where like, okay, we all team we team on our stream work. So everybody being individuals, like, oh yeah, it's my world or whatever. If if you if you express yourself in my world, you gonna get put down. Like no, express yourself, and then it's like, what well, what you expressing? Is it bullshit or is it actually some real shit? You know what I'm saying? Cause like it could be another thing like okay yeah you expressing my world but it's your bullshit with some real shit and we can get we can make it teamwork make dream work but yeah that goes to say like the personality types and then the, um the INTJ and the INFJ and shit like that so yeah so like when you go out and outside and shit like that you should never feel like some guilt or like shame or whatever when you notice some some guilt some shame you, you notice it but like don't be like okay don't feel no type of way about it just like okay I just know this is some bullshit right there. I can either turn that shit to something else to like, cause like how I see is like when there's like bullshit coming to you, like the the guilt or the shame, turn that shit into like positive, like not like we all peace, love, peace, light and shit like that, but turn that shit into something else, inspiration. Cause you get inspired from that shit, real shit, that guilt and that shame, that like that, that, um, that projecting and shit like that. You turn that shit and direct it to something else because all that shit that's coming to you is free energy. You know what I'm saying? Cause like niggas don't think like okay yeah 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 this happened. Energy use any use everything like a bitch. Anything can be used like a bitch and direct that shit to wherever you need to know. <laughs> hey like this shit this shit more than like what's like what you what you play with and shit like what you hold and what you handle. This shit way way different. But you direct that shit like if if a, like a nigga cussing at me or whatever, I'm not gonna take it serious or whatever. And also, I'm like, okay, okay, I, I can use that cussing for like, you know, motivation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cuss at me more. Cuss at me more. It's a, it's a sick, twisted game. But I'm explaining, it, but it's actually like some real ass shit. Like you got, you got to be crazy to like, you know, do this type of shit. It's not like no normal type of shit. Like how normal people, the norm, it's like that. Like, oh yeah, you got to do this way, this this way. Yes, you, there should be organization, and organization, in what you do with your life. But like, also, it's like, man, fuck it, like. Cause it's too, it was too basic. You know what I'm saying? That's how you grow. It's shit like that. We you too, ba we too normalized and not, not like everywhere. Like mix it up a little bit. You don't know how, you don't notice how things work. You're not like going around with life. You're not living. You're not really living. Cause living is about going through life and learning, going through what you're not 
with the unknown and shit like that. It can be kind of shaky and spooky, whatever. But it's also, it teaches you how to live life. It's learning and living. Instead of having these crutches and shit like that. It can be scary going throughout, uh, like losing the crutches and shit. Because it's like, okay, you're so used to this space. You're so used to how things are working and whatever. But he's like, okay, man, like, you know what? It's like, I need to, like, let go. You know what I'm saying? Let go of this shit. And, like, let me, like, wiggle, like, go around and shit like that. And then if I f stumble and fall, oh, well, fuck it. At least I, like, at least I, um, I experienced that. And then, like, I can actually use those things, type of things as that I experienced and then utilize it for, like, like what I'm going through and shit like that. But going go to that, like, you know, going to a room and, like, whatever, you should not feel no guilt or shame. You know, you should feel like okay, yeah, I'm, I'm no, I'm, I'm no. It's like I'm around different people that don't have, that don't love themselves, that don't cherish themselves, and they just feel type of type of guilt or shame. But you know, I was gonna keep on doing me because I'm not gonna stop for nobody because they're not gonna stop for, for you. They gonna they're gonna keep on throwing shit at you. You know what I'm saying? They gonna continue like you know being weird and awkward in um in a, like an in insecurity way because there's something wrong with being weird, and awkward, especially on stuff because it's that's like. You know, you've been using this for all possibilities, but being weird and awkward in an insecure way, you know what I'm saying? You should never like feel put yourself down for somebody so they can feel some so they can feel good because they're gonna turn that shit on you. And that's how they that's how like you get taken advantage of. Them. Cause like it's saying like, oh yeah. It's like saying sometimes you can be in that in that in that position where like, oh yeah, I should put myself down, lower my ego. You should always lower your ego. That's what I'm saying. You should never be a narc or like trying to be like a big head or whatever. But like being modest. Well, I should be I should be humble. Like you should never like put yourself down. You should never humble yourself. You should be modest. Like, okay, I know I'm aware. I'm noticed that, okay, this this is how this is. And I know that, okay, this is how this is. Okay, I chill out. You know what I'm saying? Because you should have a balance with it. Too much of anything is not good. But yeah, like... Cause like they just like once you humble yourself, that's how they take advantage of you and put you in their world. But you gotta be modest with it. And to be honest, fuck everything. Like, cause like all this shit, all these things, like these men, um, these like physical things, these three D things, like you know, just shit like this. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck everything. You should have a balance with it. It ain't something like, oh yeah, oh, 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 oh. I'm taking over everything. I'm taking over everything. I'm the king of the world and shit like that. Like, nah, like. This shit, this shit really simple. You know what I'm saying? At times it can be like that because like if we have different moves and different emotions and shit like that, that we gotta take um, power control. But at the same time, it's like man, fuck these, fuck these thoughts and feelings. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how, that's how we, that's how, that, that's the actuality of it. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm talking like, no, no, fuck that shit. Like nigga, like I'm talking, but like at the same time, there's some things like like okay, chill out and shit like that. But like, man, fuck it, you know what I'm saying? Real shit. <laughs>